Hello everyone, Reza here. In this video, I will showcase a Kudo board application that I built using Microsoft Power Apps. Let's celebrate your team members, birthdays, anniversaries, shoutouts, and more. Create a board, pick your team member, and let your team share the goodness. Let's check this video out in action. A CUDA board is a collaborative board where your team can post messages, GIFs, photos to celebrate a team member, a milestone, birthdays, farewells, more. The home page experience shows the list of all the boards. Each board has been created by a user for a specific team member. If I select a board, this will show all the posts that have been made for that specific board. In this scenario, the board created was for Sarah. Title, Sarah is celebrating three years in the organization. Team members can then add posts to the board. The post includes a title, a description, rich text. They can select from the available GIFs or upload any image or GIF of their choice. So let's create a new board for James's farewell. The recipient, I'll pick James. I'll go ahead and create the Kudo board. The board has been created by me for James. The board is open, open for users to post. If I select, the board is currently empty as there are no posts yet. Let me be the first one to add to the board. Thank you, James. I'll give a description, rich text. I can pick from the available GIFs or in this case, I've uploaded a thank you image. I'll add the kudo. Since this message was posted by me, I have the option to delete the post. I can add multiple posts. Signed in as another user, Sarah. Here is a board giving kudos to Sarah. Sarah can see all the kudos that she has received. For James's farewell, Sarah wants to post here. She can add to the board because the board is open. Sarah has gone ahead and posted to the board. On similar lines, other users can do the same. Reza, who created the board, has the option to lock the board. Once the creator of the board locks the board, no more posts can be added to the board. Notice for Sarah, the board for James shows as locked. Sarah can select and see all the details, but cannot add more posts to the board. For any other boards that are open, Sarah can post to that board. The Scudo board app is actually a gen page that was set up in a model driven power app. Where is the navigation for the app? Well, in the URL, I added this token to remove the navigation. Let's remove this. Here is the model driven app. Now in this, the same Kudo board design, I have added different variations. These are simply different styles. The data is being saved in my backend data source, which in this case is Microsoft Dataverse. Two simple tables, boards. Here I store the title, the recipient. This is a lookup to my user table. I also have column to track whether the board is locked or not. The second table is posts. This includes the title of the post, the body, rich text, 
board. This is a lookup column to the board table. So to which board does this post belong to? And I also have a column here. This stores the image that the user uploads or any of the GIFs that the user selects. To build the UI UX for the CUDA board, I leveraged generative pages. Here is my model driven power app. This includes the standard Dataverse table components, views and forms for my boards table and my kudos table. And then I have my generative pages. These are React based pages. These I built by simply prompting the app agent. Here's the preview of the board. If I head over to the code, here is the React code that was generated by the app agent. I can continue updating this experience by simply prompting the app agent, or I can edit the React code myself. I've done a full series of videos on how to build generative pages. Do check that out. To create them, simply go to new, describe a page, add references to your tables, provide images as inspiration for the app agent, describe what you need, hit generate, and it will start framing the gen page. This entire CUDA board experience is a solution in Power Platform. This includes my model driven power app, the tables, and also the security role needed for users to create, update, or delete data in those tables. For the model driven app, let's look at share. You can share the app with your users or security groups. And when you share, you'll assign the security role, Kudo which in turn gives them access to perform actions against the Kudo board tables and the app will be shared with those individuals. This entire solution was built rapidly thanks to the intelligent application capabilities of the Power Platform. This Kudo board application is responsive by design. And that was a demo of the Kudos board application. If you enjoyed this video, then do like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And thank you so much for watching.